One Owner Car Guy, oneownercarguy.com, at the auction. Whoa, Danny. We'll have to look on the way in. Yeah, that's awesome. One Owner Car Guy, oneownercarguy.com. And that shut off on me because I didn't do it right. I never do. I always forget to push my button. Don't be pushing my button. We're here to look at quite a few cars. I already see the yellow truck we're after. And they do have a big truck here Danny's looking for. But to start, we got this little Ranger. I don't know if it's a splash or it's just a step side. I think it's a splash, but I'm not sure. I know it's a 4.0. And we were thinking they could have just pulled this thing around because it's got that tow bar and some kind of a CB. I had noticed. Cobra, yeah, it's got a full on old school CB. So we are definitely talking the kind of thing or some older couple or something probably was towing this thing around. Sounds good. Dual exhaust. They don't want to go in reverse. No, it goes in first, first, it'll do it. I like it. I ain't scared of it. I ain't scared. No reverse. I ain't scared. No reverse. Well, yeah, there's reverse. It just, it's just a little noisy, like your woman. I thought it wouldn't go into that. No, no, I got it. She'll go into it, too. Hey, is it a four-door or a two-door? Does that open? Like, if it open, does it double open? No? What is it, a 98? No, 2000, 2096, yeah. I like. Yeah, I think they were definitely pulling something. There's a... I gotta look underneath this thing. Oh yeah, it's clean. They didn't drive this thing. They pulled this thing. Firestone tires on this thing. Firestone! Firestone! They must have just replaced them. I drive a Firestone. Oh, yeah. They're they just replaced new. them. Brand new. Okay. Did you get an email from her yet? Ooh, Miata. You oughta. We all oughta. I like them with the hard top. 08 with 179. My God. I'm not into no that new. A first gen, 92, 93, 91, I think. In there, a little bit less money. That's not a cheap car there, even with the miles. Auction walk around, buddy. And there's our caddy with the symbol, heritage of ownership emblem in the placard thing on the deck. It was only number two. That was only number two. You know what that is, right? They, get, we, they got them up to 40, but like, or more than that. Yeah. That tells how many caddies they bought new. Yeah. They kept track of them. No driver, window broken. Huh. Phrasing. I think it's a little off, but. No window. It's broken. Well, I got that much, Daniel. Does the motor's wrong? It's wanting to come up. Oh, it's in there? Oh, there it is. I see the motor. It's off track. It's off track or the motor's bad. <laughs> I need to know if the motor's moving. It feels like it got a motor mount bad. Hey. Is the motor moving a lot? Nothing wrong with it. I'm just trying to freak the guy out behind me. It's still got the cassette tape in the plastic. 41,000 miles. Colorful this going under the seat to where no one steals it and such. I gotta open up the hood and the trunk. AC is ice cold. AC is ice cold, dude. Feel this shit. Feel this. Feel this. It's gonna move. 
Dude, I'm trying to scare somebody away. Don't give me no shit. <laughs> <laughs> I would have preferred you went, Whoa, whoa, stop. Don't do that. No. <laughs> you know? I was thinking it. That's for sure. Back in the back. Yeah, they got it extended. Jeez. I'm doing this as bad as Danny is. I know. I'm looking for the button. There is a button on this fucker. Really? Over there, huh? Oh, right there. Yeah. Oh, there it was. Oh, yeah. Stay. It's original mile. No, it just means stress. That one's broken. It's bent and broken. So is that one. That hurts yeah. so heavy. Yeah, it's original. I'm gonna, um... I'm gonna get a picture. Oh, dude, that's so hot. And it's the kind you want. It's not, And look at them wheels. Oh, I popped the trunk. I wanted to look. You like that, right? You like the car, right? Oh okay. Plato's. Oh, wow. That's not good. Eh, not really. It does for driving it. But, hey, look at this. You'll like this. I gotta post this to where I can take a new Instagram picture. Um, I'll just post it to where I can show you. Finish it up, finish it up, finish it up. Come on. This was at um, Fontana. Yeah, but this is a man's toy. Have. This is a man's world. I don't that? even know why this is on there. I only see it when I... It's all bagged out. It's hard. Well, hardly cool. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it's a good way to ruin a truck, right? We well, just dropped the bag in your park. Yeah. Uh-huh. Try it out. Start it up. Let's see what it does. Paint it. It's been repainted. <laughs> Definitely been repainted. It's a sport model. I do believe that, too. They put Michelin's back on it. Dead. Pop the hood. Scuff's been scuffed here and there. Little scuffs. It's definitely been painted. Not that there's a whole lot wrong with that. On these years, it's getting to be about time for paint. Um, it's faded on the bumpers. We'll be looking at this one tomorrow, but it's not the kind of thing that I'm gonna be so hot to trot on, simply because, well, let's put it this way. It's missing this. So it's definitely had a little bit, it's missing the little things broke off, and that's pretty common. But these things go so cheap, it could be interesting. But when it comes down to it, I'd rather drive that 4.5 or 4.9 Caddy than this stinking SL500 any day of the week. That Caddy will be driving when this thing's falling apart. However, the staggered wheels and everything's pretty sweet. Scuffy stuff's here and there. Dropping oil. Mm. They probably just washed it. I'm trying to scare them away. Scare them away, dude! Get these out of here! Hey, whoa! I don't know how I missed that. If that's got low miles, and it's a HSE, the Rover, they're awful on maintenance. But, hey, did you get an email? Yeah. Really? Oh, it's only got 106, Danny. Ooh. Oh, wow. Yeah, I like these a lot, sorry to say. EAS manual. Which means our air is broken. Or, perhaps, they have already switched it. Headliners in these are awful, always. I'll bet the ABS light goes out. I'm usually pretty confident in all them lights going out. Aluminum body, pretty much 100% if I'm not mistaken, on these rovers. It is an HSE, so you've got the 4.6. Got an upgraded k and filter. It is flashing the EAS code. So I'm gonna check the suspension. I'm thinking it's been replaced. Yes. 
full on spring suspension. So the major problem with this has been addressed. Little scuffs and stuff. I honestly love a scuffed up truck like that just a little bit. This one is hot. It's exactly what I sell. I'm not cool about it being an SE versus an HSE. I would prefer the HSE, but when I think about it, in this year, I think in 02 they were all HSEs. I'm not sure, but essentially, I don't know that there's a whole lot of difference on what the options are either. So I am going to take a couple pictures, tell you to add me on Instagram, instagram.com forward slash cereal marshmallows, loving Mick loving this rover. Excuse me, sir, could you please stay out of the picture? Go ahead, try it. Uh, hang on one sec. One sec. Do what you gotta do, my brother. Whatever you gotta do. I'm done. You wanna try out the tranny or something? Do it to it, man. I I'm loving this. Well, the air suspension's fucked, just so you know. Yeah? Yeah. AC's blowing cold. You already tried the tranny? Yeah, try whatever you want. Did you try it? Yeah, I tried it. You know, it's good. Well, I know I kind of dig it. Can you dig it? Did it pass? Yeah, I like it. I'm going to shut it off for a little more. Shut it off. You can, I guess. You've got to make sure to shut it off. ABS lights on, which is scary. Um, needs a headliner. Air suspension is gone, messed up. Air suspension alone, tons of money, right? Come here. Come up front. Michelin tires, brand new Michelins. It's all replaced with coils. So it doesn't have air suspension? Not no more. Gotcha. It's been converted. It's been converted, so you don't have those problems. Hallelujah! What? Converted. <laughs> Get it? <laughs> so I like that. You like that, right? I'm loving it. it I even like my Thully rack. You want to leave it on? Sure, man. So where are we going, Danny? You're the numbers, man. I'm just following you. And oh, I love that caddy. Come on, Danny, where's the numbers? Where are we going? Three, 183. No more ones? No more twos. Ones or twos? There's a one is a Honda Accord in 1990. What number? One what? Well, that's where we're going then. Come on now, dude. Keep us in order. I'm, here. I'm following. You better be learning faster <laughs> than me following. Actually, I'm leading while I'm following. How does that work? These are getting cheap, man. Little Coopers. I kind of dig them, especially in the little Clubman model. They're beamers, dude. Yeah, shit, crap, junk. Yeah, yeah, that. I think this is our Honda right over here. Yeah. 106 in park. <laughs> that was a show on like BET, I wasn't it? I think so. Is it really? So. Ken Gariff. I don't know. Are you kidding me? Is that unlocked? Like somebody's gonna, seriously, this dumpy little freaking. Okay, I like this, Hon this like Honda's even less. Actually, I like this car. I wish I could pop the hood and figure out what motor it is. It's a 90, and I'm going to go ahead and take a picture for the heck schmeckity of it. Yeah. 
Little beauty mark. Mm -hmm. I love it. I want them to have beauty marks like that. Mm -hmm. It's not front line ready for some other douche. I want the guy, that, oh man, if that van is low mile, this guy is all over it. Oh man, van, van man, Stan. Now we're we? It's all the Ranger, it's all the Honda Accord. Well, we have no more one? No, that one was, we only had one one. One one. I gotta check out the van. Basically, I just stay in each lane as long as I can and go this way all the way through, but we got to look at our list too. But like you see something like this, I mean, this is exactly what I sell, man. It'll have too many miles probably. God, it looks clean though. Good years on it. No number in the window though. That's kind of scary. Yeah, no number, man. 3-3, three, three. that means it probably went through last week. I'm gonna look at it anyways. Should've took it home. Woo! I would've never believed that! I'll bet you they stole this thing. 183,000. So clean. It's so clean for that. Oh, look at the Greenwood. That could be a Greenwood package on that vet. If I'm not mistaken, old 80s, 90s conversion type thing they had for them. Kind of like a light Testarossa look. They didn't get into the front spoiler, which kind of looked goofy anyways. It is nice. Airspeed! That looks dopey. It is cool how it pops off. Is it only 60? Yeah. No. I, I, I bet it's that. Yeah, they're guaranteed. Dead. It did. Oh, that sucks. I like the spot. It won't go for much. That's what I need to drive through town and look at my truck. And look at your. It's been repainted. It's got a little paint on it. Yeah. It's gonna ruin my picture again. No. That's what she said. I was like, will they get to it? Yeah. So basically, what you're saying? What? I said that she liked the Range Rover Black. No, and what's next? Are you gonna buy your whole car? Tell her I already did. And it's nicer than yours. How you doing? Man, if I was doing any better, I'd be wagging my tail. <laughs> Sounds good at least, huh? Yeah. 116 on a Nissan. Wow. Auto. This is a manual. If that was a manual, Danny, I'd be halfway interested. Little clean Sentra GXE. Chrysler 300. God, and things are beaters. They go through so cheap. And they're all, you see so many not running and such. What year? Does it say? Oh, 95, uh, 96 and up. Junk. <laughs> That's what I'm saying. They look really nice. Well, yeah, they're nice. I had a, remember the E55? Yeah, I love that car. It was cool. But like the body fall apart around that damn motor. Especially with that motor in it. Yes. That's about the speed limit here, huh? Yeah. Fucking A, and they work here. Yeah. 288 on the camera. Here's an HD. Yeah. Same truck. As, as an extra cab. For what now? Put a dump truck on that. No, you couldn't really. Mm. That's a little light. 
Not with you, I wouldn't try and pull. You gotta have a one ton plus, not even a three quarter. Full ton, I would think. God, too many miles, but I sure would buy another one. Three what? Here's our mismarked one. <coughs> it's gonna go for more money because we're all gonna think it's fun. This is the kind of thing where it gets up front and you make a big deal out about it. They're like, how many miles does it have on it? And then they have to make an announcement. Force them to make the announcement. You don't find many of these shitholes with stinking owner's manuals in them. Smallest non dual overhead cam motor. It ain't worth it. It could go so cheap, it's pitiful though. It's worth it for a cheap car. What? 400? But dude, yeah, right. That's the only thing, is they're gonna bid it up past that. That car will go for probably 8 to 12, and that caddy probably go for 9 to 15. <laughs> but come on. <laughs> With a third of the miles on it. You know, people love these fucking pieces of shits. Yeah. Would you clean up your language? I'm gonna make a video here, Danny. Jeez, for fuck's sake! I want. I, I like them, man. Oh shit, yeah. Looks like it's got a Kager in the back too. Twenty-five hundred. You could load two. Okay, we'll have a fucking party right here. Holy shit, that's beautiful. Just not high enough. It's not the biggest one either. Yeah, it is. Insane, bro. I bet you they hauled weed in it. It's from Colorado. Yeah. It was their delivery truck. Oh, man. 236. That makes me a little more confident in these junkers, though. What was it? Three what? Mini fours? I think that says... Three 183 and three 189. 183, huh? Did we just look at 183, Danny? What is 183? SLV? Huh? Silverado 4x2 EXLS. Is that the one I just said? Wow, I didn't look at that Dodge either. It's going this way. Yeah, but it ends. It ends right here. It should be right here. Because there's 184, and 183 in front of it is a Mercedes. Are you sure it's three 183? Well, I believe you. I think this has 236, but it sure look. It sure looks like 330. Holy hell! Sure is clean for that kind of mileage. Oh yeah. Oh, I love those. They don't offer the crate motors anymore. I wanted to redo these and just dump crate motors in and repaint them, and you can just offer warranty trucks. But they don't do the crate motors no more. Them avalanches are starting to go through so cheap it's pitiful. Yeah. My mom liked it. Wow. You know what? It's a leather one. It's a TL? Or what is this motherfucker? I think so. For 473. We're a ways from it down at the end. That sure is nice. 63,040th anniversary, Danny. Beautiful. 
clutch gone. It is a manual. Wow. Not you. You break. Yeah, because nobody knows how to get it off. Exactly. Yeah, it works just fine. They just don't know how to do it. Because you gotta lift up just a little bit. You don't just do it like a. I'm gonna leave it on, and hopefully it causes a problem tomorrow. No, it won't move. The idiot driver's gonna break this, bro. Bro, the clip. How about this? It's in gear. Right now. Why? It ain't going nowhere. No clutch. <laughs> oh, that's classic. It just said that right here, clutch going. I, I love it, dude. This is a good car. My mechanic can take care of this so easy and cheap. This is hot. I'm gonna leave the window down because it's self locker. Can't get both of them. It's just, it, it, yeah, we can't, we can't figure it like that. Wow, all maps. Uh, I don't know where it is. It's got the glass hatch too. Yeah. Yeah. It's a Targa. Targa top. These are in nice condition. Hold on, let me see what's on. Yeah, here. Hang on, hang on, hang on. I used to have to ride in the back of this or my sister did on the way to school. My mom. Okay, we were going that way, huh? And we're kind of still looking here. Yeah, that is nice. Let's um. It says self lock. That's why I left the window down. You want to be in the picture? No, I want to get a picture of this so we can put it on our list. Okay. Just hold your horses. Plus, why would you take one that way? This is the Sunway. God, I love that stinking damage on the fender, bro. That is just perfect. And couple tips on the channel while I make videos here. Um, you might have heard my buddy Danny say, hey, let's buy both of them. And I'm like an old hermit, like and stuff. Well, I'll tell you why. Um, never, ever, ever go to the auction and plan on buying any car. Never ever ever want any car or any two cars or anything like that Look at everything you can and plan on the one that you want somebody else bidding on or bringing their buddy and paying too much Always just buy what the deal is never get ready to buy before but Go ahead and stink and preview and Preview the hell out of them, but planning on buying is hard and Plus we're not trying to spend as much money, but a lot of this is going to come out I think it honestly is just from having the car cover on it and having it tied down to it and something brushing against it. Some of it. I love the years. I think it's 91, 92 where they started getting squared off on the back lights. Um, the guy has paid good money and he's put some nice good years underneath the car. And they're not just good years. It's a nice, nice, nice set. Uh, it's a F1. It's a, it's a evil F1. Yeah, oh yeah. I'm a Michelin Top Hill PFG or Goodyear fan, I guess. So we're looking for other stuff, checking these cars out. And like Danny said, he's trying to pull the shit up. He's got the list. 473 actor. Any more threes? 
Hello? So there was three 189 and that was the 82 Jaguar XJ6. See, that would have been over there too. We didn't see it. And what else? Is there any low threes? No, there's just three 183. Okay, as long as there's no low threes and then four what? 73. Which was what? The Acura Legends. The that, 1990 Acura Legends. That wasn't in its spot or I would have seen it. Okay, 515. Dude, it's not 515 yet. Come on. I know. I know. Oh, I see the wagon here. Okay, I'm going to clip this off. I'm going to make another video later and do a double. We are here previewing for tomorrow. Tomorrow is the big auction. And we'll be previewing two more auctions tomorrow for later in the week. With that in mind, this is the TRA stuff, total resource auction. Dude, in a coupe, 70,000. Let's look, check out that motor. Um, this is nice. 01. This is very nice. Danny, this is a nice car. Probably a 31 or a 3800. They're not too big. You just, That's what she said. You just did see? Yeah. 34. Oh, that's the good one. Just one of them. And the 38. 31, 34, 38, 33. I'll take any of them. I like this car. It's got a couple dings, got low miles. It's clean inside. 25, 30 mile a gallon car. Service engine lights came on. Low oil, let's check the oil. Low oil and service engine light just came on. I mean, it doesn't have no weird pings. It ain't smoking. Can you hold it? They just put oil on it. Water in that oil. Not smoking out the exhaust. It's a nice car. It's a good 28 mile, 25 mile down car. I like it. One owner car guy, oneownercarguy.com. Back with you for a part two or something. I'm actually all over this 300. And like, Danny was a little not into it when he seen the paint. And I'm a big fan of damage. It goes cheaper. And then when I started it, he's like, oh man. And so was I. It sounds nice. Could you give it just a little bit of that started and do that just a little bit while I'm in the back? I want, I want everybody on YouTube to hear. Listen to this. Nice tires. Yeah, Michelin's. God, that sounds nice. Go ahead. Ah, <laughs> they're Magna Flows too. Look at there, a little bit of crappy crap coming out. Yeah, it's got a governor or something. Michelin Pilot Sports with little titties on the side. And the interesting thing about a 300M like this is it basically just this. Even though they didn't make the offer with that motor in these years. It's basically what it is. So I'm all over this car. It's a cool car. And we're going down here. We know where I've been looking for one of them. I am looking for one of these simply because everybody hates on my Aztecs so much. And I like the Aztecs. I ain't even gonna look. It's got too many miles for me at 152. Pontiac vibe though. Look for one coming on the channel someday. Someday. No rush now, no rush. Okay, there's your white. That's too expensive, it's new. Oh man, me and Danny were looking as we came up. Marauder right here. And I'm gonna go ahead, I gotta give you the start because I'm here. Okay, I'll go to the back. Yeah. Oh, look at that right here, I didn't notice it. Pretty nice. Hear that pointing? 
Need a little bit of upper engine. A little bit of valve adjustment or something it needs. Tick, 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 tick. Look at this, special edition. Heritage, something from a dealer. 36,000 original miles on a 96 convertible Corvette. It's not a Z06 or anything like that. I mean, a ZR1 or nothing, but. That's the deal. So this is what we looked at while that was off. Little A3 2.0T. Nice car with only 92. And on to the ones that we know where they are. And I'm walking towards what I came here for. There's two cars here that are exactly why I came up here. I need this Grand Wagon here very badly. The only problem is, is how much somebody else needs it too. Sunny California plates, absolutely love that. I'm gonna get a picture before I go, but I didn't like how that door was open for my picture. Oh my God, the records on this thing in the back of it. Oh, come on, they took the do not use four wheel drive. Well, sunroof. No keys, so we can't hear it run. We can look under the motor, though. I like the little light. Yeah, on both sides, too. Oh, really? Yeah, that's added. Did you see this, Danny? Yeah. Pretty nice, dude. What motor is it? Uh, type 90s, I think? I don't know. 360, I believe. You didn't look at it, did you? No. Yeah, there's some cool records in this thing. I don't even know where to put them either. It's too cool. Audi S7. Yeah, buddy. Okay, well, I am recording. However, I'm hooked up to a little pebble that's on our list. Seats. Absolutely beautiful. Wow. They actually do feel like they're redone or something. Battery's been left on. So it's dead. Pop the hood. This thing's clean. It's clean. It's a 380 SL. What caught my attention is how clean these wheels are. It is 78,000 miles. Oh my God, yeah, I believe it. I really do believe it. It's not the most popular of years, but it's a nice little car. Paint's all faded. I'm going to get a picture for. Um, Marcus, my buddy in Germany. I know he's looking for SLs a lot. Although this may be a little too new for him by a couple years. Okay, going to the other side here, the dog side. And I will talk to you in a minute. Batteries are going to shut this off. Okay, we just looked at all of this, and we'd already looked at all that, but my battery went dead, and I lost about 26 minutes worth of video. So we're going to go walk a lot of this again and check it out. Um, there's three or four cars over here I wanted to show, including a Marauder, a Jeep Grand Wagoneer, and some others. And we got to look at that little Acura, 183 or something. Yeah, we watched it drive past us. A little seafoam green, bluish light, blue. It had the air conditioner sound. It was missing like yeah, it. It was yeah. missing like a C. It's not. 
I don't think. Oh yeah, in the van. A little combi pop top Westphalia over here. Yeah. Forgot all about that. And the stinking nice excursion. I wanted to throw that in here. Now all these will be going through tomorrow. And I'll be seeing as many of them as I can and seeing what they go for and such and bidding on them. It's a 138,000 mile 2000 excursion. And the seats inside and everything are just beautiful. But this, awesome. Pop top Westy. All your hookup bibs have been replaced over the years, it looks like. I didn't open the back last time. Maybe that's why. Vanagon L. I don't know what the L means. Maybe long. But I do love it's got the factory cool old stuff. It's even got the, the wing out table. There we go. Yeah, buddy. I could live here. I don't want to get out. It's got your stove and stuff. Zinc. Look at them. Funky seats in the manual. 112,000 on it. Dash isn't cracked up. It is all it's cracked up to be, but it's not cracked up. Okay, there was a Corvette down here I wanted to show you. And a Marauder. Mercury Marauder. And the Cherokee, or Grand Wagoneer. Bingo, bingo! This one doesn't run right now. They don't have a key with it. The back seat looks to be. Look at this. I lost all this. I was showing you in the other one. Every receipt that I think the guy ever got with it. My frames are bent just a tad bit. Clean truck. I'll be bidding on this one. For sure. Look at the wheels. Black and gold. Gold and chrome looks good with that black. Spotlights aren't factory. It's a little dings. But it's got the sunny California plates, which were original in 89, I'm pretty sure. Up until about 90 or 91. Nice truck. Even the wood grain up here is still looking good, which usually fades out one of the first couple things. Marauder and Corvette. Marauder and Corvette were right up here. The white? Yeah. I guess we were looking at those first. But I wanted to show that 38,000 mile caddy over here. They must have brought some stuff in around it. Yeah, they backed a car behind it. Yep. 36,000 original mile convertible 96. It's in just pristine shape. The only thing wrong with this car is somebody put these stupid freaking wheels on it. I mean, for a 30,000, 36,000 mile car, I mean, the caliper, it's not even really a caliper. It's a caliper cover. So, you know. Yeah, it makes it look cooler with the wheel, but stock would be much cooler on this. And just like a Chrysler, a Corvette has, well, not just like a Chrysler, but just like a Chrysler has a unique sound. These Corvettes have a very unique sound as well. As do these Marauders. We also found a, he's got a little upper engine noise. You can hear it, valve noise. It's pretty peppy though, man. Basically, Mr. SVT Cobra motor in a whatever the hell this thing is. Marauder! And they got the little fireman in the wheel, too. Okay. I think that was about all we were going to look at. Ooh, this is actually a nice little truck with the right miles, alloy wheels. Dakota 5.9 RT. Oh, man, they smell in here. It's been detailed, but well, I'm in it for fuck's sake. <laughs> you didn't even 
Not hardly. Oh, God. Nice little wheel well molding. I like the truck. It's pretty cool, a little 5.9 Dodge Magnum motor. It's a 526 Hemi. Not really. <laughs> We're gonna put this on the list though, for sure. Yeah, that could be why they traded it in. But yank that off. I doubt it. I doubt it too. Hello. Can I do for you? Right. What can I do for you? State your business, or I'm done with the call, man. Sorry. Yeah. Fuck yourself. You hear that douchebag? No. Call up and just grill me like four times about calling for Nathan. Hey, I'm calling for Nathan. Yes, what can I do for you? It's calling for Nathan. What can I do for you? Is this Nathan? I'm not going to play 20 fucking questions. I'm not in an interview. You call me, motherfucker. God. This is me off to no end. I have people asking, why are you so mean when that guy called? Because that guy's a douchebag. Fucking dang. Tom, right? Or something to that. Something along that line. Sounds nice. Dude, go stand back here and let me rev it. For the what? I see it's like watery black build. Did we already look at that dually? What dually? Yeah, I got 07. Oh, 07 it is. I mean, it's cool. That's cool. Wow. With the right miles in a first or second year edition. I don't know. Alloy wheels. They are actual shit cars, but this is... Wow, plastic hoods. I didn't know that. Leathered out. I don't know. It's a nice... Let's see what he's got here. I like these for cost. Yeah. I, I, got a shit I could tell that when I started it up, but still. It says Betty Boop on the license. That's because I'm be Betty Boop when I buy this. Boop boop a doop doop. I think that's what she said is boop boop a doop. My grandma used to like Betty Boop. Dude, that car's gonna go for like two, three grand. Oh, this guy wants to argue again? Hello. Car of the Rue Shopper. Oh, Calling here we go. 1966 Jaguar Bar 2. wanted to see what the last number. I'd rather see this Acura. We were supposed to be right over here somewhere. Do you remember the number? Hello. Yeah, I guess it, the phone called you back, or I don't know what happened, but you're looking at a Jag or something. I'm going to get this blue Jaguar that you have this Jaguar. Okay, what can I tell you? Well, it's been a while, and I, I, like, I have some questions about, I'm going to buy one, but I just don't know which one yet. You know, I'm just trying to make up my mind. Okay, what questions? What can I help you with? Well, I want to know, does it run? Okay, watch the video. Everything's in the video. You didn't catch the... I don't have the video, huh? There it is. I looked around, but no, oh. I don't. Okay, well, it's on there. Where's the video at? It's on there. Let me get you to the actual website. It's probably going to Car Gurus or something. It's, um, if you go to... I'm not getting it. If you go to okay. one... Okay. 
If you go to oneownercarguy.com. Okay, okay, go to one. One. That's the numeral one, right? Yes, use the numeral. Yes, ma'am. Oneownercarguy.com. One owner, O-L-D-E-R. One owner. Owner. One owner. Yes, ma'am. Sorry, I'm at the auction. It's a little loud. Carguy.com. Yeah, okay. And that'll be on there. There'll be a video and everything, and there'll probably be a lot more pictures. I don't know where he's looking. Um... Uh, I'm looking at, uh, I, just, I found this, I contacted you on February 7th, uh, it says it's in Oklahoma, California. Yeah, the car is down there in San Diego. Yeah, and I contacted him on February 7th, but nobody got back to me. Oh, I don't know. I, people that call through this car guru saying really fall through the cracks. I don't even know what happens. It, my phone rings, and then I get a message, and it says, hey, you've got a call from a car guru shopper, and sometimes it connects to somebody, and sometimes it don't. So I don't know. I see. Uh, yeah, I never did get through. Uh, what I wanted to know, uh, it, 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 it shows great in the picture, and I don't, and I don't mind fixing something up. I've not done that before. I've restored cars before. But, uh, you know, I, I love Jaguar. Yeah. It's a good car. It's just been sitting. The, when I drove it last, it needed to have the brakes bled and a little couple things like that. And it needs a tune-up for sure. It's been sitting a while. And I think it has it been repainted. Oh, yeah. I'm sure it has. Yeah. Well, where did you find it, sir? I don't, you don't mind me asking you. Uh, that car came from L.A. It did. Right. <laughs> but actually, I actually, I got to, I'm at the auction getting ready to bid, so I got to go. But I will tell you this. It's a very funny story, but not funny at all. The guy's going to come look next week, hopefully. But he, there was a guy in L.A. that had a, a house here and a house in Denver or something. And when he left and went to Denver, he let his son drive the car. I don't know why anybody would let his son drive a 66 Mark 10 like that. But he did, and when he came back, lo and behold, his son had got a $1,000 title loan, and that's how I got the car. The title loan place ran it through the auction on him while he was gone. Okay. So the kid went and got a loan, the kid, the kid went and got a loan and then didn't pay it for five months while his dad was out of town. His dad got back six or seven months later, and his dad ain't got no more car because the title loan had sold it three months ago or something. But kind of interesting. Oh yeah, oh yeah, that's a good title and all. It's, it's down in the alcohol. Right. So check out the video and let me know if you're interested. I'm always around. Well, I, I'd like to see. I never buy anything unless I. Right. You can look. You can look anytime. Just check out the video and if you're interested more, just give me a call back. Okay, if, give me your number so I don't have to go through this dealer thing. Okay, okay, it's it's 406. 406. 546. 546. 8748. 8748. Yes, ma'am. Nathan. What is Nathan. 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 Yes, ma'am. You know what I want? You know what I want to do? What's that? Car. I get it. What's that? I'm going to. Uh, uh, I'm going to make it into a limousine. Oh, that'd be I'm cool. Oh, that'd be really I'm cool. I'm, I'm a driver. I'm a limousine driver. I'll bet you get a premium. Want, you get a premium out of. I bet you get a premium out of that too. I want no. I want. I want. I want a classic car. I had one once before, you know. And, and I want a classic car to drive to pick up customers with. You know, something really showy for my company. It's only a two fifty. And uh, that's what I want it for. I want to get a lot of attention. Oh yeah, for sure. Okay, well, I'm... Uh, I, of course, I need something to run. I don't, now you're in, I'm down in Palm Desert, California, and it's, uh, it's hard to get people to work on these cars. Oh, yeah, it definitely is. Um, For sure, it takes a little yeah, somebody special. You, you just do that, and we'll hire most of the mechanics, and then we'll work on them. That's no problems, and I'll help you out. Oh. 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 She must have been lonely, brother. She's nice. Uh, she's super sweet. But... The questions just get a little bit crappy. So, Danny, we never found that car. What Cadillac? Oh, we showed this. We showed this. No, come on, really? I believe you. That's one of the nicest cars here. They could have changed the number, or they could have took it inside for a detail.
It was like three something, right? Look, a crap box. Should be right next to the Camry. Right in that spot. Really? Yeah. Well, I don't mind taking a look over there before we... Is this thing really supercharged or is it just fixed up? It ain't got many miles. It's locked up. Maybe it is... Oh, it's sold. That's last week, man. Danny, I really lost the highest Sold, I really lost the Jeez, dude. Remember that? No. No, you used to take hey, uh, hey. mini made hey. auction. Yeah, I do remember that. Hey. Yeah. Still running? Yeah. What's that, like an hour and a half? Hit it. Dead center, everything's good. Ice cold AC. Love it. Yeah. This is a sleeper. No one's looking at me. Well, hopefully not. Well, you know, the thing is, is everybody that's scared of them doesn't know enough about the suspension to look. Right. I'm not scared of them. I just look and I know the suspension's good. I'm happy. Yeah, exactly. You gotta know. Other than that, it has some electrical ghosts on them sometimes. Yeah. But that one's clean. That that's, one. that's not some piece of shit that somebody's ripped apart. That thing's exactly. a clean car. Clean car. All I know is, dude, the big thing that I can't do when Samantha's not here is order pizza. I can't order a pizza. What do you want me to do? Order one? Well, I'm thinking we can eat a pizza tonight, huh? Yeah, we can It's not DiGiorno. It's delivery. I wanted to see if this is a, a, a GS or not. I don't think it is. Or you wouldn't sand your little GS sticker off. We're in the 60s. Did we come right here? Oh my god, look at it. <laughs> I knew to be up here somewhere. Yeah, I would take this over lots of cars. Like the new Skyline, fuck that. I'd rather have this in a heartbeat. This is going up in value, that's going down. I like the wheels on it. Oh, I love them. Yeah, this is totally going up in value. It's like the only Honda I would want. Yeah. I couldn't name any other Honda I'd want. Mm -mm. This is just cool as she's neat though. Piece of shit, bro. Yeah. How about this? You like the razors probably. I love this. You're Mr. Off-Road Man. No, I love this. This is gonna be so cool. I'm loving that red interior too. Incredible. Red and black. That ass. That ass, Danny. For what now? This one. For what? I don't know. I can't explain to you how to look at eBay while I'm walking around previewing cars, bro. Come on now. You're killing me, Smalls. Dude, is this a Dawoo? I think it's like an, inf is it an infinity or day woo woo. It's an infinity. It's infinity. Fucking, I don't know the difference, dude. This is a kind of cool car, and it could go pretty cheap, by the way. Q45, I have the exact same thing. The Q45. Q45, I have a 98. This is a 99. Why would you have one of them? You thought that was cool? Is it before you were saved?
Manuals and everything. It had a bad steering pump. Mine did. This is a clean. This is a pretty clean car. Can you pop the hood? Bro, this is right before the body switch. I am totally not a fan of the... Come on, you had one! Maybe I'll pop it again? V8, yep, I thought so. I like it. I like it a lot. Is it really the one I want, or are you just saying that? Oh, come on. I don't know what all the S and the 3816... Oh! This ran through today and sold? Bro, I think this sold. Couldn't have. Couldn't talk. Six cylinder, faded, nice condition, low brakes, huh? Whatever the hell that's supposed to mean. This car could go cheap. No tears in the top. CD changer in the dash V8. Wow, it is a V8. 89. V8. I don't think it is. I don't know if it's a V8 or not now. I don't really. I did. I really did. I wanted to give it to the benefit of the doubt, Danny. It is not. But it sounded pretty throaty. It's because of the exhaust. I'd rather have that freaking Infinity. And I'm not a Jeffinity fan. 227 on Explorer. How did they do that? Okay, I'm going to shut this off before I lose this too. Thanks for watching. We'll talk to you. It's actually working for me to charge this while I'm walking. That's kind of cool, actually. I'm pretty happy with that. But I'm pretty much done here. I'm going to just take the last look. And then we're heading out. We're done. The only thing we couldn't find was that stupid legend. Dual exhaust, special edition, something here. <laughs> yeah, you do. Thing's got so many miles. You'd be fighting against everybody here. You'd be, yeah, it has. You'd be fighting against George Martinez and George Hernandez, and that thing's going right to Mexico. His old one, huh? I'm a fan. I'm a fan of this car. The question is, how good did Nissan make V8s? <coughs> I like that. They're holding their value. That car is 40 grand, and now you probably go for 
be lucky to break two. Which one are we talking about? Oh, you're talking about the AMG. Oh, well, I'm talking about the... You're still got your head in the clouds, dude. You're a cloud guy. 245. I can't afford your, your, your thinking. Even you just thinking is too expensive for me, bro. As we walk towards a $15,000 bike or something. <laughs> I don't know what it is, but it ain't cheap. <laughs> That ain't the one we've seen, is it? No. No, not the Wow. Mm -hmm. It's a nice Beamer next to it, yeah. I like a Beamer. They're nice riding bikes. A victory. Uh, Goal achieved. We walked 10 miles. You hear that? 10 miles. This thing is like, this looks like they welded a Harley and a crotch rocket together. I got an extended swing arm too. I tried to have her take a look at it, but can you move this, sir? It's, is that cool? Is the R cool? Wow, that's a cow you want to be. I got your Hayabusa for you. I got your Hayabusa. I like saying that, I think. What is it? Okay, one other car guy, we're done. They got all kinds of bikes. We ain't gonna buy no bike. We're just looking at bikes. We might buy this bike, it's cheaper, I can tell. That is a nice Ninja. Look at this, if you've got this on your bike, you're probably a douche. And you're scared you're gonna run it over. Yeah, they're afraid they're gonna knock it over. They weren't racing it. Give me a break. It's like these guys with the F-350s that like... I know what it does. It's a cage. It's like training wheels. Yeah. Dampen off this thing. I take a picture and go. Can you cock that wheel a little bit better, sir? Or does it have to be like that? That's awesome. I like you that. What is that? A 650? Mr. In-house bike pro? You don't even know or what? You just gonna be quiet? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I thought you were gonna tell me something. She's more than six fifty. It looks it, don't it? Oh, it's a ten R. Yeah. I like the gold. I like the gold wheels. We done.